What's up, gamers, and hello to all my Sunken Land fam out there. So I have posted roughly 35 tutorial videos on this game, and I, quite frankly, am out of ideas. So my plan from this point going forward, no, I'm not going to quit playing Sunken Land because this game's dope and I love it. But I'm just going to transition into kind of Let's Plays, to be honest, man. Um... Until we get some new updates, obviously, or we find new game mechanics, you know, I'll be the first one to jump on top of getting you guys informed about that kind of stuff. But I want to do some base remodeling. So I hope you guys tag along for the journey. If you like my content, man, or maybe this is the first time you've ever watched one of my videos, uh, please consider subscribing. I greatly appreciate it. Um, I love this game, and I love other survival games, and I'm posting, you know, three to four videos of all kinds of different survival games every day. So if you like that kind of stuff and that's your jam, consider subscribing and liking this video. I'm trying to get all of my videos to 100 likes. That would be freaking sweet. Uh, but either way, I've got, I just got done placing some new planters down here, and I swapped from cotton to trees. Um, a couple of these ended up s still getting cotton seeds because it's very hard to pick them up, pick them all up without uh, replanting them. But I collectively have, you can see how many cotton seeds I have, man. Uh, you could tell that I've been growing the crap out of cotton. So I have enough cloth to last me a lifetime at this point. Um, I've got a full, full chest there as well as a full chest there. So we're sitting good on cloth for a while. So I'm switching it up to trees. Uh, hopefully to, I know it's going to be a pain in the butt to cut them all down. I wish we could just click on it to collect the wood. Then that would be, oh my God, that would be a lifesaver. That would be an actual lifesaver. There's really no point in growing lemons from what I understand. Now we have, we have some recipes over here that require a lemon, but they also require cabbage. So there's nothing we can do because you can't get cabbage. I can't wait till we can get cabbage and marble and hide in the game. I'm curious what their thoughts are are, are going to be on hide because they have, you know, the ability to convert hide into leather, but there's nothing that contains hide. So I think, you know, wondering if they're thinking about like adding like a type of animal or something to the game. That'd be pretty cool. That would be pretty cool, but I am officially out of wood uh, because I just used it all to make all these planners on this side. And I still have another half a row plus another full row before I really get going here. Uh, this is my helicopter hangar. Uh, it flies in here nice and easy. reason I have it on the ground instead of up here is because until they come out with an update where my helicopter doesn't fall through the floor every time I log out and log back in, then I'm just going to be parking it on the floor for now when I log off. So my little bit of remodeling idea here is I originally started out really liking this whole... Uh, really liking this whole downstep situation like this. Uh, but I've gotten to a point now where I'm I'm just not a huge fan of the way that it looks. So I'm going to make everything on the same level here, and we're just going to make a really big base that's going to encompass the whole entire island uh, and be surrounded by these cool-looking little stair defenses. There's nothing saying that this little stair defense thing is really going to help me a lot in raids. Right now, currently, I have raids turned off because I had them on insane. Uh, the raid frequency was turned to like very hard or whatever the heck it's called. And I'm telling you guys, they were kind of, a new raid was coming about every minute and a half. So that's why I was like, let me come up with some ideas. Let me build some stuff and let me test it and see if it's going to hold up on this big old island right here. Right. So most of you know, we've got these four uh, little towers on the outside corners that hold the detectors that tell us when raids are coming. So I'm going to probably try and redesign those. And yeah, more or less, I'm going to take apart those bottom three floors over there and try and come up with cool ways to more or less make this place more defendable. I'm thinking about making a balcony around the whole entire outside of the whole thing so that I can go out and, uh, you know, defend from the outside things such as that. But I am going to I got to go get my last video I made was the weapon video and I put all my I put my pickaxe up and everything. Did I put it in here? Nope. Maybe over here. All right, there's my pickaxe and my axe. Uh, maybe get the packing box too. So I think what I'm going to do, it's going to be quite a process here, but I think I'm going to start destroying some of these stairs. 
some of these stairs that I made. I think that's really the main play, the main focus. Um, my loot room, I believe I'm going to put on the other side of the helicopter hangar here. And this will be the loot room. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like it. I like it. And we can also branch off in different directions, go this way a little ways. Uh, we still got plenty of island to cover. And plus, you know, I'm not 100% sure if I can shoot through the stairs, but it would be cool if I could. I imagine I can, but there's really no way for me to test it uh, until I... Hold on. There might be a way for me to test it. Maybe I just get a foundation, put it on the other side in the water or something, and shoot at it and see if it hits. We'll see if it hits. And grab this while I'm down here for sure. Uh, one issue with this uh, design here is I'm going to have to build some sort of dock. Uh, that I can get into my base from because if I get out here, there ain't no way in hell I'm gonna be able to get back inside <laughs> um, All right, so let's just put this here for now and just come back here and see if I can sh do damage to it Or if I shoot the stairs, you know All right, let's see what we got oops um, well mm, It does look like I did damage to the stair instead here and there is no damage done to that guy. Okay, well, apparently I can't shoot through those. So we'll just have to figure that out. Honestly, at the end of the day, dude, I could just make a ton of grenades. And grenades, you know, damage enemies through objects. I could just literally, if they're all like packed up right here trying to destroy things, I could just throw a grenade at them and be done with it. So I don't know. We'll figure it out. We'll see how it works. Um, I am going to start deconstructing a lot of stuff. So bear with me here. I do have these chests full of trophies. I should, as a matter of fact, I should probably get my new loot room set up first. Uh, um, how am I doing on iron? Oh, I've got plenty, actually. I've got plenty. Now, the question being, do I want to stick with metal chests or do I want to go with ammo boxes? Uh, ammo boxes are pretty dope, really. But they're kind of pricey as far as wood goes. Food containers don't really stack too well, although they do look pretty cool. Um, I don't know. Do they stack? I guess I could just try and see here. Get some components. I don't know. I really like the look of the metal boxes too. So, uh, where's me components here? Let's see. I guess they stack all right, but eh. I don't know. We'll just take it a step at a time here. So what I'm probably going to do is I'm probably going to do a lot of running back and forth to get all this loot over here. All right. So first thing first, let's put up some walls, 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 walls. Okay, that makes it nice and dark in here. Yeah, go ahead and stack it too, too high. Not a huge fan of the single high ceilings. Not really my kind of jam. Makes you feel a little squished. All right, so with that being said, I think I'm going to change this to a doorway. And same over here. Okay, because I think I'm going to start my little outside balcony thing here. And I think we'll cover this in reinforced um, and just, you know, wrap it around pretty much my entire building so that I got somewhere around the outside to run and shoot. I think that'll be pretty cool. So if you guys didn't notice the metal chests, um, actually a few of the Storage containers actually got changed. I don't know if you noticed that or not, but these used to cost components and now they do not, which is cool. I guess I'm fine with it. Let's see if I can successfully like separate these or maybe I should just like nut them up. There we go. Yeah, that looks good. All right. I don't need to place too many of them because I can literally pack up the rest of them 
But this should help me uh, get started here. Should help me get started. Oh, I got a couple iron from that node. I need to go dump in the furnaces. There you go. Oh, more steel. I converted a ton of my iron to steel bars, especially since they increased the time uh, that it takes. So I've got, man, I got like 14. I got another 26 over here. We're ch -ch -ch chilling with that concept. Um, okay, so let's see. So I'm actually going to try and see if I can... If I can... Get a separate box for everything. I'm gonna see how that goes. Uh, we got a lot more space over here now, so. All right, the stupid bandages from all the raiders, all the worms from all the raiders, coal. I'm gonna have to get trophies over here to uh, stay on top of what goes where. Try and train my brain to figure that out again. I don't know if all these are grown yet, but man, this is going to be interesting to chop all that down and see how it goes. All right, candle, uh, lantern. I don't have anything in there, so we can take this one and this one. Um, the telephone is all my cloth. Okay, take all. Oh my god, that is just terrible. Terrible, terrible, terrible sound with the take all button. Eat it up, buddy. Eat it up. All right. Let's see here. So let's get my telephone. Matter of fact, actually, let me uh, get this. Cause I do want to do want to make stacks of these puppies. If I can stand in the right spot, please. That would be awesome. Okay. So telephone. Wait, I forgot. I already crap. I'm losing my mind. All right here. So that's already charcoal. So we can go ahead and put all this here. Um, now the candle is definitely charcoal. That's not a candle. This is a candle. Candles for charcoal. But I don't want to... I don't want to freaking... need more boxes. It's getting dark. I can't see anything. I can't see anything. All right. Give me that. Yes. Am I all out of scrap now? Yep, all out of scrap. So let's take these two. Um, nope, hold on. I don't know what this chest is for. Nothing, apparently. Mm, duct tape and things. Okay. That's all my rubber. Rubber, rubber, rubber. Ooh, we can take this gas and put it in this one for now and take that chest. Yoink. Okay, that's all my expensive stuff. Ammo. Wood is empty. Kind of. Ah, oh, crap. Ah, oh, crap. And I can't sleep yet. All the craps. All the all craps. Okay, it's getting to the point where I can't see anything. I'm going to put this lantern on the floor to hopefully help with that a little bit. Uh, okay, let's get these positioned up. Get in the hole, brother. Oops, wrong button. <laughs> All right, there we go. So for now, that will work. Let me get this candlelight put up here on the top. All right, so we've got charcoal, we got fish bait, we got bandages, and this is going to be our cloth which is the clock as far as I can remember um, we'll make this one which will be my scrap okay and then really can't see Jack diddly man where'd that candle go there it is put you up here okay you are my wood holder box you don't really have a purpose so you can be Duct tape. You can be duct tape. You're my one for my ore. Okay, I need to see if I can sleep, bro. Holy crap. All right, finally I can sleep. We're awake. We're doing the thing. Um, Take all. OK, 
Okay, let's get this guy and this guy. Perfect. Slowly but surely moving everything over. I think I'm going to try and see what happens if I try to collect uh, some of that wood there. Yeah, I think this is going to look slick over here, honestly. Especially with more space, more storage. I'm thirsty. I'm hungry. Find something to eat and drink. There we go. You happy now? All right, let's put this up here. So this is going to be my food. Food chest. Actually, I'm going to keep that on me. Um, Yeah. Actually, let me go ahead and turn these into herbs. Herba derba derbs. Okay, everything else looks fine. So here's my gasoline and my chemical substance. Um, rope, I believe I'm going to put in this same one. Matter of fact, let me turn all this into rope. Not like I really need it, but just for the sake of being organized here. Okay. That's all rope now. Okay. Let's see here. My wood chest. All right. Need to refill my water bottles. Okay. This is only about halfway too, which is nice, which means I will be able to separate quite a bit more, but I am going to need some scrap. Which I'm going to be disassembling a lot of stuff here on the bottom half of this whole place. So that shouldn't be too hard to do. Ooh, the money box. The money box. This is where all the money is. Okay, how much ammo do I have actually? Can I still have quite a bit? Still have quite a bit of stuff and all this. Okay. Wouldn't take this stuff, I guess. Oops, dropped that one. Yep, it only gave me one chest, so let's see here. The rubber ducky is for my money stuff, which I'm just going to put all the fiber in there and then all these. And I'm just going to put the duck in there for now because I'm going to go disassemble a lot of things that I use scrapped for, maybe. If I have anything. I think the majority of all of it, well, except for the roof. Um, Let's see, how do I get up there? Probably going to go ahead and pack up my generators for now. Pack up the generators and the spotlight. Okay. All right. Let's take apart the roofs. I can pack up these lights too, I think. Yeah. Nice. Pack up the lights. Yeah. Only getting one scrap per roof here. Kind of sucks. It's fine though. Not a big deal. If anything, I've got like five islands I still have yet to loot. I went and killed all the bad guys on it, but I haven't looted them, so I can go get more if I need it, I guess. Um, let's see. Can I do that? Oh my god. Okay, cool. All right, yeah, because I don't think that was enough scrap. Yeah, that ain't enough scrap for nothing. That ain't enough scrap for anything. All right, well, I'm just going to freaking dump all this in here for now. And go get some more scrap, and I'll be right back. All righty, I got me some more, some new scrap. Make some new chests and get the rest of this inventory transferred over here, hopefully. Hopefully. Um, Let's see. Metal chest. Here we go. Come on now. Try and get them as aligned as I absolutely can here. Okay. Come on. And find that sweet spot is rough. There we go. All right. So with that being said, um, Ducky can go here for the money chest. Money! And we can start finding a home for glass and components, maybe. Go get the rest of it. Let's put all of our freaking electronics, advanced parts, components, all that stuff in here. 
and metal stuff like that. Um, I am going to just put this chest in the middle of the room with all the hanging lanterns and such. All the furniture type crap. Okay, there's that. Let's go grab some more. Some more. I need more. Dropped a bunch on the ground there. Oh my god, dude. So much. Wait, how do I have so much? What the? That's weird. I just accidentally duplicate something. Jesus Christ, I might have. What the heck? Good lord. Good lord. All right, you go up here. There we go. All right, generators and stuff can go in there. Clock. Come on, you can do it. Okay. Ooh, wait, what? That goes there. Glass, maybe? You go in there. Okay. We almost got all of it transferred over. Back this guy up. Ah, oh, the rubber. I can't pack him up. Don't have enough room. Okay, so this is glass. We could do rubber here. So many rubber. That goes like that. Uh, metal sheets can go there. This can go here. Atari. Nice little Atari. Let's see here, what do we got next? Like fish skin and hides or something. Ain't a whole lot left. That's almost the majority of the loot. Last little bit will be ammo, I think. Okay, let's take all that and pack that up. And shotgun. We'll start with shotgun. Okay. Maybe smokeless powder too, if I got some of that. Okay, yeah, grenade. All right, we'll start there. Start there and then come get the rest of it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, you got a home, you got a home. Shotgun ammo now has a home. Okay, smokeless powder can have a home. Come on, get in there, buddy. Get in there, you can do it. Okay, shotgun ammo, black powder, bolts and arrows, rifle, and then pistol. Shotgun. Okay, so all my gunpowder and grenades and crap can go in here, maybe. Maybe gun parts, too. That's fine. That is fine. Okie dokie. Almost got everything transferred over. Yay. Ouch, my ears. Ouch, my ears. Boing. Oops, I tried to hit my head on the roof. Hey, I kind of did it. All right, one more chest. Okay, right there. Yep, nice, 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 nice. Um, grenades. That's a gun. We don't want to do that. There's our black powder ammo. There's our rifle ammo, which I've got plenty of. Pretty cool. And black powder. Sort. Yes. Arrows. Sort all this. Okay, that goes in there. I don't know how this pistol got in the ammo box, but I'll go put it in the gun box. And then we'll wrap it up, my friends. So yeah, this is going to be kind of a daily video, I think, the way I'm going to do this. We'll see. We shall see. But thanks for watching. If you watched the whole entire thing, go ahead and comment down below with, uh, you know, 
Try and squeeze the word wood in there somewhere. This is going to be a mess to do this. An absolute mess. You can't exactly chop it easy. Yeah, it's going to be a mess. Gonna be a mess to do this. It's going to have to stand in circles. I'm going to end up destroying all my planters, probably. Oh, my Lord. What have I done? I don't even know if I'm swinging at anything. Yeah, this, like, definitely needs to be just click to collect type of thing. That's for sure. Click to collect, please. Click to collect, please. This is too much. I can't. Having to chop all this shit is just... Oh, it's going to be a headache. That is going to be a headache. Well, all right, guys. We'll see you on the next one. Peace out. Bye. Woo!